Hello. Uh, in this video, we will see some of the typical features used in the Mosaic software, which comes with the Tuxen camera. So as you see on top, we have four options here, capture, image, measure and report. Let's run one by one here. Now, in case of capture, typically you use exposure control to control the light intensity. You can select auto exposure, which is like the uh, default setting of light. The white balance, you have to ideally lock the white balance so that uh, all the colors are presented in their true format. Image adjust is you can do some uh, changes with respect to the saturation, light and contrast. If you have messed up anything here, you can always click default to get the default settings. File save. In file save, we have two options here, use dialog and use file name. When we use use dialog and click on the save button, you get a dialog box here where you can save the image. When you select file name, you, you can select a path here and accordingly all the uh, images that you capture from here will get saved to this particular path. Now next, uh, the image. So in image, we usually take the images which have already been captured. Now in this case, I have one image here for representation purposes. So this way I double click here. So I come on this. Now from capture, we have come to the image option. So this is my captured image. Now I can do some operations here. Like, you know, I can adjust the image settings as I want. Or if I click default, it will go by default. I can also do some other, you know, this, these options are not required here. Typically we use these images to adjust the color contrast or any other uh, parameter amongst these. Now this is one of the most used features in the software which is measure. Now in case of measure, we have these number of measuring tools, which I'm just showing you for demo purpose. So this is one line which I have drawn. So you get the corresponding parameters here. Accordingly, you can select some of the shapes. You can also write something. You can delete the image. So these particular options are used to uh, do some measurements. Now let's say this is my measured image. I want to save this measured image. What I do is I click save image as which is this button and I go wherever I want and I save it accordingly. So now this image which is created here is my saved image. You can always go to the path where you have saved and open it in any uh, photo viewer as such. This is one option which, okay. Um, now other, some of the features here are, let's say this is the uh, graphics property. So in graphics property, you can determine what to do. I mean, uh, to change the parameters of this line. So let's say I can just show you one. So let's say if we click on line width, so see, you can see the width has increased. Also this text. Now this, you can change it accordingly. Hola. And this is to basically, sorry. Yeah. Now this is basically to move the shapes and this you can delete these readings. So this is another graphic property which is very important. Ruler, most people, no, uh, yeah. Uh, okay. So the ruler is basically this grid of sorts. Scale. Now show scale. Now this scale is ideally very important. Once you calibrate the system, uh, there is a video of calibration, which uh, I have already prepared. Uh, you can check that for reference. So yeah, once you have done these kind of measurements, you can always go to save as and save the image accordingly. In case of display, you have these options called so zoom in, zoom out, full screen. You can also flip this horizontal or vertical. Uh, and yeah, configuration is all the options that are seen here. This is the particular camera which is in place. So currently I'm using my Chrome camera which uses the Mosaic software. And info basically is just the information of the uh, software. And if, and if you click on the report, there is a standard report template which takes the image and all the readings and gives you uh, a PDF file. So if you require that, you can always click, uh, use the report function, which is there by default. I hope that helps. Thank you so much for this. Thank you for listening.